We're back in America's dairy land tasting the many ways cheese pairs with everything. One of the more interesting pairings that's been increasing in popularity over the past decade is pairing cheese with sweeter items for a full flavor experience. Ken Monteleone, who owns Fromagination in Madison, has been pairing sweets with cheese for years, so I asked him to explain some of the finer points to me. You want to start with the most mild cheese and end with the strongest. If you start with a blue cheese, and then with the soft cheese, your palate's gonna be so fatigued, you're not gonna really taste the flavors. You said blue cheese. Well, it's a hint of blue. I should say it's more of a cheddar with a hint of blue. Okay. This is one of my favorite cheeses. It's an American original made by Chris Raleigh in Charlesburg, Wisconsin. He's okay. a fourth generation cheesemaker. And this does have a little bit of blue in it, huh? but it's cheddar based that it's going to hopefully wow you when you taste it. Okay. So what we're gonna do today is we're gonna taste the cheddar blue with another favorite product in our shop, which is um, KP Toffee. So, you know, a lot of people don't think of toffee and cheese. It's like, why not? Savory, right. sweet, desserts. You know, there's no rules in terms of when you should eat cheese. Candy with the cheese, why not? So what I want you to do is first, taste a little bit of the Dunbarton Blue. Okay. Now, I do taste the blue, for sure. But what I also taste is that smooth, and, and really delicious flavor that goes along with it as well to me. The cheddar, so that's interesting. It's not a real strong blue taste. And a lot of times people would pair uh, blue cheeses with honey and walnuts. Mm -hmm. And in this case, we decided to, uh, let's try toffee and see what happens. All right. Dive into the candy here. <laughs> I mean, I can definitely tell that with the, the little bit of a bitter with the blue, but this is so delicious as well, and it really complements each other well. Yeah, who would have thought that sweets could enhance the flavor of cheese? It's a combination that definitely pleases the palate, and the great thing is you don't need much to feel satisfied. Now that's a real treat. That pairing was decadent, so I was curious how cheese would pair with truffles. Luckily, Julie Waterman of Indulgence Chocolatiers in Milwaukee makes great chocolate and shares pairing ideas at her chocolate pairing bar in Walker's Point. This isn't just like your average chocolate we're talking about here. I mean, we've got the, just great ingredients that go into this. And tell me a little bit about that, if you would. Sure. So we try to use as much local ingredients as we can. All of our dairy, our cream is local. And um, I think you're going to taste the difference later on. I can't wait to taste it, that's for sure. Is there a specific type of you know, chocolate that you're putting together for the, the pairings that we're doing with the cheese? Yes, so when we pair, um, we put a lot of thought into it. Um, all of the chocolates that we make are made specifically for the item we're pairing to. So tonight's cheeses, we select our cheeses first. We taste them, we think about what we're pulling from them, the concept that we want to create um, between the pairing. And then if we don't have something that will already work with that cheese, we go ahead and we make a custom chocolate to go with it. So is there a lot of taste testing that goes on to try to oh, make yes. sure you get the right? Toughest part of the job. <laughs> Every first and third Thursday of the month, Julie conducts chocolate pairing classes, and I can't wait to see how these cheeses pair with her flavorful chocolates. I often hear the question, well, why cheese and chocolate together? What is it that makes them work? And cheese and chocolate tend to work together because chocolate's intense. It needs something to be able to stand up to it. No question, cheese and chocolate is the perfect dessert. More proof that cheese literally goes with anything. Wisconsin cheese is amazing on its own, but when paired with other foods and beverages, it brings out even more tastes and textures that will please your palate. Smooth, creamy, bold, and delicate, cheese definitely helps create some perfect pairs. I'm always amazed at the infinite ways cheese can be used. It's one of the most universal foods that pairs well with so many things. I hope you've enjoyed learning the different ways Wisconsin cheese can be paired with different foods and beverages. Thanks for watching, everyone. Join us again next week as we continue to Discover Wisconsin. This episode of Discover Wisconsin, America's Dairyland is brought to you by the Dairy Farm Families of Wisconsin, the Wisconsin Milk Marketing Board. America's Dairyland is my land. Am I going to get a super big sugar high off this? Oh, yeah. That's all right. <laughs> Cheers so, to Wisconsin cheese, right? Yes, indeed.
For more information and bonus clips from this episode and past episodes, go to discoverwisconsin.com and don't forget to follow Discover Wisconsin on Facebook, Twitter, and Discover Wisconsin Radio all across the state.